Hey, this is our Frank Valente with EXP Realty in Northern California. And a lot of agents ask me, should I buy real estate leads? I'm always getting asked, should I buy, should I pay for leads? So here's some thoughts on that process or what I look at. For newer agents, I really think that you should go after the low cost, less riskier options for leads. That being your sphere of influence, open houses, and depending on your market, maybe if there's some expired listings for sale by owners. And by going after these type of leads, again, it's much less cost, much less cost, less risk financially, and you're gonna be able to work your skills before you start purchasing leads. Now. When I talk about purchase leads, we're talking about typically things like Zillow leads, Facebook leads, Google AdWords, or maybe you're going to pay a third-party company that's going to do a combination of those for you, okay? So here's some considerations. You know, the first consideration is think of a budget. You know, think of, you know, what those leads are costing, how, what they're, they're guaranteeing they're going to give you. So what, you got to have a, have a budget. And also, you got to be able to hold that budget accountable. So typically, a new lead program, I think of a three-month run to see some, to see get some traction. And I certainly don't want to go beyond that if I don't have traction. So I want to be able to budget for maybe three months and not really get a lot of revenue out of it. Also, if I'm signing up for a program, I definitely am wary of anything that's going to be more than a month-to-month -month program. Maybe... A lot of times you may have to sign up for two, three months and then month to month, but that is a max. Absolutely, that's a max. You want to have something that you can get, get out of. And maybe the most important consideration is you got to have the systems, the technologies to service those leads. So let's talk about that for a moment. So think of that person. They're online. They're going. They see the house on Zillow. They click in. They give the information. What does Zillow do? They sell that lead off to four or five agents. Now that person that's looking for a home, they're probably gonna to go to another website. They're gonna look at another home. They're gonna put their information out there. Boom, that lead just got sold to four or five other people. So in the course of an hour or even, or even a week, that lead got sold to multiple agents. So you have to be the first one. And when I say the first one, I'm talking the first minute. So it's coming in on your iPhone. You're driving, you hear the beep, the thing beep in, pull over, take notes, be safe, get back on the road. You're at dinner, excuse me, I gotta take this call. Go, take the calls, talk to the lead, otherwise you're wasting your money. Or you have to be organized, maybe have what we call like an inside sales agent type to, to help you with those leads. So if you got any questions on how to strategize and what leads to go after or how to, how to you know, build your business plan, Please call, text, and have a great day. Bye-bye.